we're gonna test some of my hand loads. Um, but I'm particularly interested in the, the ballistics of the Hornady 155 grain XTP bullet. And basically, um, uh, you've seen this before, it's a Glock 20 10 millimeter auto. And one of the things I just wanted to show you is since I last shot and got some feedback on, you know, basically the, the, the issues with my grip sliding around, I found something really neat about the Glock 20 and the Hogue handle grip that I had uh, basically laying the ground. It goes right over the finger grooves of the Gen 3 Glock and actually sits to be a little bit more pronounced on that. So that's that's really nice. Um, if I were to go over just basically what I've got here on this mod on this this Glock 20 modified, I've got the True Glow um, fiber optic tritium sights with yellow in the back, green in the front. I've got a six inch KKM precision barrel stainless steel. Uh, what else do I have on this? Obviously, you've seen the Hogue handall grip and. Uh, it's a cleared gun, nothing in the chamber. So inside here we've got the stainless steel guide rod and the 22 pound spring, which makes it really nice if you've you're gonna start um, shooting hotter loads and uh, as I've seen earlier today, somebody was down in the area with a chronograph setup, and my hand loads, at least one of them, was, was, was traveling at uh, 1,418 feet per second, which is really nice. So what we're going to do is just do some shooting, and uh, it's going to be a really quick video. I didn't make up a whole bunch of rounds this time, and uh, we're going to take this guy and have added some water jugs there. So uh, we'll see how that goes.